Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. And you say they made it after you placed the Moonstone? Do you know why, or what it means? Does it have to do with the Snidgets? The breadth of one's knowledge can be as wide as the seas, and yet only run so deep. It's good to see you again, Doran. Did Poppy tell you about everything that's happened? She did. And I am glad to see that you are both safely returned. I did question the wisdom of sending you on a path at a time when that path was unknown at best. Deadly at worst. But the acumen of the centaurs is neither personal nor partial. The skies tell us what is to come. And often we do not know what we have seen until it has come to pass. You knew the poachers would try and kill Poppy and me. I did not know, my young friend. But I shall say that I was not surprised. It was in much the same manner that I expected our first meeting. I don't suppose you'd like to start from the beginning. I think Poppy and I could use that. Of course. I find it is often the best place to start, is it not? Many, many moons ago, I divined a series of events. Hey, Cody, what's going on, buddy? Their meaning long evaded me, until you brought news of the Stidgets and their poacher pursuers. I believe the symbol created by the moon calves dance marks the place the Stidgets are hidden. And serendipitously, I believe that I know the very place. Please, go on. I have seen that symbol only once, <laughs> on a rock face in the cliffs of the forest. I'm at the end of the game. You should make I'm almost there. there. The snidgets that have been kept I'm pretty there much for there. so many years may no longer be safe. If you're right about this place, then we should make our way I don't know if completing like, these two, like the there. side quests with like, the main people can actually affect we the ending or not. to lose the snidgets once again. Why? Oh. Your water in your basement? Are you kidding me? Get a little um, a little flood. I'm missing something here. Is all the snow melting, I'm assuming, or did a pipe burst? All right, well, I guess I'm doing the main quest then. Oh, I see. That stuff sucks, though. Is it the, uh, it's downstairs, you said, right? Yeah, basement. So, uh, is it like, um, it's coming through, like, the foundation or some shit?
Victor Rookwood is dead. He confronted me as I left Ollivander's with the Keeper's wand. I had to defend myself. Godric's heart. Are you alright? I know. Yeah, you're man, well I would definitely uh, check that because if it, they enough. might like, um, but Rookwood himself might get moldy and shit, eh? If it's the uh, if it's the foundation that happened to one of my buddies at work. He would have Sorry, me that happened to one of my buddies at work, and he had to he had to spend like had forty no grand to fix right. whatever you the hell no was wrong with the you foundation or what whatever it was. Do. It was fucked. The wizarding community owes you a great debt. Thank you for saying so, Professor. I'm ready for what's next. All right then. The keepers have been waiting. Definitely don't want it to mold out the drywall and all the wood, though. You have completed all of our trials, and you have done so under circumstances even I did not foresee. You understand now why all of this was necessary. The port key, the vault, the locket, the book, the trials. To ensure that one with the ability yeah. you and I share yeah, for sure. the same Yeah, like I said, it, it costed Buddy at work like 40 Charles grand, but I think it was, his was like did. right fuck though. Just, I think it was like flooding the basement by like a foot, foot and a half all the way through. Is at stake. I think. Everyone is what they seem. As you know, light does not exist without shadow, nor shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Even the most well-meaning and competent amongst us Cannot possibly know that yeah, if it's only the one spot, then it shouldn't be like, be it shouldn't be terrible. What lies in the repository but must anything be with foundation is going to cost. Resist right? the temptation to destroy or control it. The magic that you have so carefully honed must now be used only to protect the secret we keep. You have the wand. You will know when to wield it. We leave our legacy oh, in good. your hands. It's very good. Yeah, man, the map the map for this game is actually surprisingly really big. I actually completely forgot about the bottom right half of the uh, the map until like a couple missions ago. Oh, the flu flame, the flow flames, yeah. We can only hope that we're not too late. I gotta get those too. But a repository I think I'm actually gonna try to plan on this, this game. Door. Careful now. I should hope that the enchantments protecting the castle would protect against an incursion from below. I fear they may not. Although, if they don't now, I can assure you, they will in the future. Were you able to reach Professor Weasley? I was. Hopefully she and the others will arrive soon. They know where to find the door through which we entered. Yeah, like completing the collection is going to be the biggest thing, right? If it's loyalists say rebellion, it cannot be far behind. You and I have faced worse, Professor. Us and him. We need to move it. I shall handle it. One moment. 
I um actually have not. Actually, I gotta start. We we gotta start that there before the end of the week. Uh, we watched uh, Black Adam last night, though. Oh, it's two trolls. You gotta figure out uh, what the uh, last one is on for sure. Professor, that wall, that's Hopefully it's not on Crave. I don't think we uh, have that hooked up yet. Let's go. Reinhardt must be getting close to finding the repository. I fear you're right, Professor. There's nothing we can do but keep searching. Oh, right, yeah, we gotta get the Chromecast going, that's right. Listen, more goblins are Oh, are you just getting off work, I assume? Or recently? Oh, nice, nice. Just, uh, just relaxing now. Mike's moved in now, eh, at this point? Charge. Oh. 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 
<laughs> Just calm down, eh? Nothing wrong with the snoring. Just having a good sleep. Look out! Another troll! This one's worse than the last two! Stop him! Just having a good sleep. Ah, uh, James. Come on, buddy. James, just in case you uh, intend to play this game, I am I am at the end, just so you know. Yeah, but he's not right. That's definitely the end of the I'm game. relieved we got here before Ranrock. I can't believe this is it. The repository has been under the castle for hundreds of years. Think of all the pain that created it. This is what Miriam, George, your friend Lodgok, and countless others died for. Miriam believed this forgotten magic could be used for such good. But she did not know the risks. She did not see what the Keepers have shown you. 
what Isadora showed you. You are now the keeper of whatever power it holds. What do you intend to do with it? Oh, I don't know. I have decided to open the repository. Its power cannot lie dormant for centuries more. After everything you've seen, what about Isadora's fate? Yeah, okay. No. You're right. I haven't forgotten. The cost is too high. Perhaps this magic is best kept contained. I'm relieved to hear that. I know the power is tempting, but I'm glad you've decided to keep it contained for now. And whilst that may be the right decision in this moment, I confess I have been thinking... What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner. Trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? I plan to keep it secret for now. But in time, when I am ready, I plan to tell those I trust everything and accept their help. I believe that is what Miriam would have wanted. We should trust in others. If anyone can rise to this challenge, my friend, it is you. The arrogance of wizard kind. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container, all of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <coughs> Seems you were two of a kind. She didn't know when to give up either. <laughs>
James, how's it going, buddy? All good? You, uh, you working today? Oh, you were? Oh, you're off now? Nice. Right on. That's good. Sorry, I'm just, uh, just so you know, I am at the end of the game in case you do, uh, want to play this game. Thanks, buddy. Thanks for dropping by. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Every time. I got you. Thanks, boy. <laughs> oh, I missed that. Where is it supposed to go? Oh, down here.
would have loved you, my young friend. The Wizarding World could not be in more capable hands. Professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you, certainly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge, he built a reputation charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And, of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. <clears throat> Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever, possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind, and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig. Well, I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can, by wisely, resourcefully, Justly and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig! I can't believe we lost Fig. I didn't know him as well as you did, but I know he was a good man. Glad Weasley spoke for him. She honored him well. Fig will be well remembered. I wish the same could have been done for my uncle. I wonder if there's a chance Anne would meet me. Sebastian, I can't imagine what you and Anne are going through. Perhaps you'll hear from her soon. I hope so. I, I'll let you know. Sebastian. There's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait. What? What are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. This... this can't be. It was the Loyalists. It's always been them. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her. And she's never been the same. So cruel. 
Rookwood deserved what he got. Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you an apology. All this time I thought goblins were the enemy. But it was never that simple. Ominous said he's spoken with Anne. I wonder if she'll see me. I'll find out and send word when I know more. Solid main story. I guess there's this wrap up and stuff. Yep, it's all wrap up. That's pretty good. All right, James, you're, uh, we're safe. We're all good. 